say, in all seriousness. That's the coolest thing I've ever seen. Yeah. So, <laughs> I just watched uh, a movie. <laughs> yeah, a movie. I guess, uh, I guess you could call that. Um, it was pretty good. It was pretty good. I'm gonna have to, it almost made my top ten. I almost made my top ten. It's probably like an eleven or a twelve or a million. The internal battle that went on through there. It's just amazing to me. Like, it's obviously a satirical, educational film for us. A heart throbbing story about, you know, the search for. the search for a place in this world, you know, it, it's a story about putting yourself out there and sometimes it doesn't really work out, maybe you're not going to have kids again, but, well, I think it was, it was very well done, I think that the point that I got was the point that was trying to be portrayed, maybe it's about the emotional damage that media has caused our children, you know, like, I'm pretty screwed up from the media, I mean, look, you look at my, look at my left eye, oh, it's, fuck, this is my left eye, look at it, right, it, it, it used to be, like, a shade whiter, and now it's stained a little red, right, because of all those late nights <coughs> watching infomercials. Um, because, you know, I couldn't sleep, but the infomercials just lull me right into uh, that false sense of safety, you know. <laughs> just to get back to the, the point, right? We all go through pain, you know. We all have that internal pain. And some of us take it out on our children or our friends. We yell at them, we hit them, we kill them. Mentally, physically, financially, or other people, they don't do anything about it. They keep it locked up inside until they're near explosion, right? And then, at their work, they feel like they're being hazed, that they were abandoned as a child, and people don't know that, people don't ask. So one day, the people, the person, with this great internal clogging, comes to work with an M16 and kills everyone, right? That's how some people handle their problems. I mean, I do that, but I'm just a big ball of sweat, you know? Sweat and tears and corruption and violence, and corrosion, and feces, <clears throat> basically, what I'm trying to say is, the movie, this BME video, Body Modification Extravaganza, is that what it's called? Well, it's, you just gotta think, you just gotta sit here, and you have to think, you have to ask yourself, what would Jesus do? And if you still feel doubtful, well, you might as well just sit back, crack open a can of Coca-Cola, <laughs> breathe in that salty air, and relax. Because, well, Jesus is dead. <laughs>